Hey, thanks for watching Four Color Commentary. I'm Mark Allen, and this is another edition of Affordable Firsts. And this particular book is one of my favorite Affordable Firsts, just simply because uh, it has languished for so long in the dollar boxes, in the cheap boxes. Uh, it, you can get it on eBay right now for a song, and it contains uh, first appearances of original characters by two uh, comic book and pop culture greats. And uh, one is Steve Ditko. It contains the first appearance of Steve Ditko's Static. And, um, you know, of course, anyone who knows comics knows Steve Ditko and knows that uh, his work just has that singular style and flair and, and attraction. I mean, look, Steve Ditko was such uh, an amazingly talented artist. And he was so unique that he could make practically, and I say practically, anything interesting. But his static character was interesting, and this is his first appearance. This is a 1982 comic, if I didn't mention that, and or 1983, I'm sorry, it came out in August, I believe, of 83. And uh, beautifully, uh, beautifully done. Uh, I'm not even sure, I can't remember if this it was this character or one of his other characters that wasn't originally supposed to be done in color, but it still, uh, it, it turned out so well. But uh, so you've got the first appearance of Steve Ditko static in this comic, but you also have the first appearance of Rio. Okay. Rio by Doug Wildey. Now Doug Wildey is a guy that uh, a lot of people don't know who he is. Undoubtedly, especially younger comics fans today. Doug Wildey has been or worked in comics uh, in the golden and silver ages and the modern age. Obviously he's passed on now, but uh, Rio is his creation. It's a Western creation, a Western character, just a great, uh, just a really cool character, great stories, beautifully uh, rendered artwork. And uh, here's the great thing about Rio. There wasn't a whole lot of Rio uh, work done. So you could, it's, it's fairly easy to come across and, and to accumulate all of the Rio work to have all of Doug Wildey's work. Now, if you wonder, if anyone out there is wondering what's so special about Doug Wildey, uh, I'll tell you the one thing that uh, all comic book fans, older comic book fans, and some younger as well, because I've got my two boys, uh, they're, they're one of my, one of the f TV shows I'm about to refer to is one of their favorites as well. But Doug Wildey is the creator of Johnny Quest, the original Johnny Quest 60s cartoon show. And um, that's, that's Doug Wildey. Uh, that was his, uh, that was his baby. That was his creation. And he, he uh, just is, was a, an amazingly talented man. So here you have, you have uh, Eclipse Monthly number one, published in 1983. First appearances uh, of a Steve Ditko character. First appearance of a Doug Wilder character. And uh, it is worth going out there and finding. Dig through those dollar boxes, uh, or just or just go on eBay and grab a few copies of it for cheap. But it is an affordable first. It's well worth it. So go get it. And thanks for watching Four Color Commentary.